Hello, good afternoon, everybody. So this video I want to show you how can you create your uh, watch list for quicker expert trader screening, which means you screen the stocks that uh, is a shorter list versus the whole market, which may be uh, too uh, long a list for your screening. It may take up some time. So first of all, you go to the top menu bar and you will see that uh, you have to select under charting. There is a button called the watch list over here. So by selecting the watch list, it will pop up onto your screen and you can create your uh, new watch list. Okay, for example, I'm going to create for um, Malaysia stocks like KLSE. So I will just put KLSE, I click OK. OK, oh, and so, uh, let me create another. KLSE uh, 1. 1. Okay, KLSE 1. Okay. See, this watch list now is totally empty. So I'm going to populate it with stocks that I am interested in so that every day when I use the expert trader to screen for trading signal, then uh, it will show stocks that I'm interested in. So, so I come to the top menu bar again under advanced. Okay, I play on it. Then you can see uh, expert trader. Okay, so you click on expert trader and your expert trader will pop up. Okay, expert trader will pop up. So the rule to use to keep a uh, watch list of stocks that are active is this particular rule called the volume increase 30. All uh, traders club members should have this rule inside your expert trader already. And then you select the duration one month ago. Okay, one moment ago over here. Okay, I'm going to do it really slowly so that you can follow in the video. Okay, and you go to this additional configuration. Okay, you go to, you click on that, left click on that, and go to KLSE. Okay, KLSE, to select uh, 30 cents to, I'm putting 10,000, that means uh, anything above 30 cents, uh, I want to see the stock. Right, the average volume condition will be 750,000 shares minimum. Average over 50 days, so we uh, save and close after you have hit those numbers, right? And you select the markets, okay? Under this, uh, apply rules to scope, you select KLSE, okay? KLSE, make sure you are selecting all stocks exclude warrants, right? All stocks exclude warrants. One minute ago, bullish, start screening, okay? Start screening, it will screen for active stocks over the last three days in uh, BUSA, in KLSE. So we wait the, for the lease to complete. So if you are trading a uh, Singapore market, right, you can also do the same, just same procedure and change the name accordingly. And if you are trading US market, NASDAQ, NYSE, and uh, maybe the Hong Kong market, those are very huge. You will have a long list of stocks to, to trade. And if you use expert trade to screen, you probably need to wait for quite long, up to what, five minutes sitting in front of the computer waiting for screener to complete screening. Or if you're using a slower machine, right, it can uh, take up quite some time. So you can use this method to create the watch list of active stocks so that uh, you know, you're only looking at stocks that matter to you. So Busa has got 800 over stocks. After I use this rule, this method to screen, I have 160 stocks, okay, listed over here so i'm only going to look for the opportunities inside these uh, uh, FB stocks my cursor over here okay, you can see there's a minimize button and a save button so i click on minimize okay when you click on minimize your list will be look like this it's in a small window like this click back to expert trader to go back to expert click minimize okay to come here so what you need to do is to Click on any of the stock, just one stock, and then you, on your keyboard, you hold down your control button and click A. Okay, the whole list will be selected. The whole list will be selected, like it will be all blue in color. Okay, and then you, you right click mouse, the menu bar will appear, and you will choose the second option. Add to watch list. Remember the watch list that we created just now was KLSE1. So you, you move down to KLSE1, you left click, done.
Okay, all the stocks will now appear in this uh, watch list. Let me show it to you. See, under watch list, if I open up. Okay, you can see KLSE1, the watch list we just created in this video tutorial. Left click on it, ta -da! all the active stocks are inside. So, these stocks will be the one that you look for screening signal. Okay, let's try. Okay, let's try. So now we will screen, for example, one of our strategy. It's called the uh, near resistance rule. Okay, if you have missed the tutorial, contact our office. So uh, I select the rule. Okay, and I don't need to select one month ago. I go for one week ago. Similarly, for Singapore Traders Club members, uh, please use this method near resistance rule. Select one week ago. Uh, no, okay, one week ago, and then uh, over here apply rules to scope this watch list and then just select the watch list that you want to screen on okay uh, we created KLSE1 so I'm going to put KLSE1 over here and I start screening okay what you will realize it it will screen faster okay because uh, instead of 800 stocks the software now only needs to deal with uh, 160 of them so the result will return uh, in a very fast manner okay see Within less than one minute, it's already 70% done. Okay, percent done. So let's take a look. Once 100%, we can take a look at uh, the signals. All right, so over 17 signal triggered over past one week. So I'm going to minimize again. Okay, and this is how you go through the list of uh, stock trading opportunities using our screening rule. So uh, Super MX. Okay, and also QL. So this is how we got all the uh, signal, and then we will discuss in the communicator, and also our new WhatsApp support. All right, so uh, that's the end of this uh, video. So I hope uh, you can now learn how to not learn, but you have now learned how to create a watch list so that your screening time is faster. And for those of you who are trading the bigger markets like myself, um, I have got. Nasdaq set up, okay, over here, watch list. Nasdaq set up, and I have got my NYSE A and B set up. So these will your screening time shorter, all right, shorter. Um, yeah, uh, if you want to know total number of stocks, Nasdaq have got 300 active stocks inside the list. NYSE, uh, the first list has 100, second list, I'm looking at about 200. Also, all in all, 1,000 uh, stocks to screen. So if you don't use this method, you are screening about 5,000 stocks every night and that's going to take up your time. Okay, with that, I shall end this tutorial. And uh, if for members who have questions or any software feed that you want to uh, learn about, feel free to drop me a message over WhatsApp. Then uh, great videos like this so that everyone can benefit from. Right, thank you very much and I will see you at the next video. Bye.